Hi there, it's Sandra. I'm going to feed Gus one of my indoor kitchen worm bins, all of these banana peels, and then I'm going to show you what happens 15 days later. Normally I like to feed worms a diverse diet of all our kitchen scraps, but the banana peels were mounting up in the freezer, so I thawed them out and decided to give them to Gus. I'm not going to do a total bin fluff here. I'm just going to push this beautiful vermicompost over to one side to create a feeding channel. Gus has been going for just over four months and I hope you'll agree that this bin is doing great. First up is going to be just a paper towel that I used to wipe up some curry powder. I didn't want to stain my dishcloth so I used a paper towel and nothing to waste into the worm bin. Now the banana peels then some pulverized eggshell grit for pH balance and grit, and some ripped up grocery bag just to add a little bit more carbon and also to help keep the bin dry. I'm going to close this up, leave the rest of the bin undisturbed, and then I'll show you what happens 15 days later. Well, it's been 15 days, so let's see what Gus's worms did with those bananas. I can see what they did with their paper bag. There's a giant hole in the middle. I guess they went looking for carbon. That's a good reminder that all bedding is food. Let's go right into this banana zone and see if we can see any telltale signs of leftover banana peels. Banana peels are about 75% water, so that's always a consideration when feeding food to your worm bin. Looks like the worms are still interested in that paper towel and still in the area. Banana peels have about 22-23% carbohydrate, about half of which is sugars, but also some fiber and what seems to be left over here are some fibrous little strings. Now I peel my banana peels from the other end so that I don't get that stubby end to a banana that you often see hanging around in worm bins. So what we're seeing here is actually left over from the peels themselves. The fact that the worms are still in this area tells me there's more for them to do here before the banana peels totally disappear. So 15 days was close, but not quite enough. Gus now has his own playlist. Thanks for following them along. Bye for now.